The federal government says it is building a 3,000 high capacity custodial center in Abuja, Kano, and River states as part of efforts to decongest custodial facilities that have been identified as major challenges affecting the Nigerian Correctional Service. Minister of Interior Raoul Farag Bishola made this known at the official commissioning of Oshun State Command Headquarters of the Nigerian Correctional Service in Oshogbo, the Oshun State Capital. Our correspondent, Olashukomi Ogumuko, completes this report. The Minister of Interior, Raruf Aregwesha says each of the higher capacity facilities will have court for trial for inmate with a view to easing congestion of custodial facilities, adding that the plan is to extend it to the six geopolitical zones in the country. Aregwesha who revealed that the nation's entire custodial facilities have maximum capacity for 57,278 inmates, said the last count earlier in the week showed a total population of 68,000. 747 inmates. The atmosphere around computer facilities and offices was discouraging and appalling. I am therefore very proud to be associated with this huge transformation of the working environment of the service. Beauty is a thing of pride and joy. A befitting and conducive workplace is motivating and inspiring. The human spirit recognizes and appreciates whatever encourages it. I join the officers and men of the Correctional Service in appreciating the addition of this beautiful edifice to the collection of such enhanced facilities to boost their dignity and morale. The Controller General, Nigeria Correctional Center, Haliru Nababa, notes that provision of this and working environment is sacrosanct to efficiency, as he lost the minister for his pragmatic leadership style. This has enabled us to address the perennial challenges that impede the service delivery. May I also express my gratitude to the Minister of Interior, and Premier of the Visitor for his pragmatic leadership and support that has greatly encouraged the Nigeria Correctional Service to try beyond expectations. Gaf Nagboyega Oyedola, represented by the State Secretary to the Government, Wale Oyebamiji, notes the contributions of the Government in renaming the Centre from Prison to a Correctional Centre, and urged officers and men of the Centre to put in their best for improved service delivery, which will enhance sustainable development. While the Senator representing Oshobo Central in Oshun State, Ajibola Bashir, acknowledged the Minister's effort at revamping Security and Civil Defence Corps, the Niger Correctional centers and the fire service, among others. The effort we have taken at the National Assembly approving the supplementary budget, which is going to put huge resources in the area of internal security and strengthening the fight against insurgency, we have a situation whereby the challenge of insecurity will be a thing of the past in the country under the leadership of our president and of course the minister for interior. The new office complex we are inaugurating today is another chapter in the resolve of the Nigerian Correctional Service to provide improved services in contemporary Nigeria which seeks a viable place in a competitive world. The senator described the gesture as a compliment to the efforts of the National Assembly, who just passed a supplementary budget that will allow more resources to be committed to addressing internal security and strengthen the fight against insurgency and banditry. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.